What the fudge is that thing? What is that? This is so sad, you guys. Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. Hey patrons. Uh, today we're watching Vikings and we are on season, not two, season three, episode nine. This one is called Breaking Point. So last episode was where they raided Paris. Um, and the well, if you haven't watched it, go ahead and click right up here and watch that one with me, friends, and then come back and watch this one. Uh, <laughs> it, it didn't go well. It did not go well. So that's where we ended off. Um, I'm curious what they are going to do. I don't know if Ragnar is going to take everybody back home. Uh, I don't know if he's going to end up going to Wessex because uh, they still have a, a problem to deal with over there with King Eckbart and how he destroyed their um, community over there, their settlement. Um, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Also, you know, it seems like at the end of the last episode, uh, Ragnar was... Ragnar knew what Floki did, at least that's the vibe I got from him. So I'm kind of curious how he's going to re uh, act with him in this episode. Uh, but at the end of the episode, Ragnar was, he was hurt. He was not looking good. So um, I'm kind of worried about him. But let's go ahead and get started. Uh, so we have two more episodes left of this season. So this one and then the next one. Then we start season four, and so I think what I'm gonna do on season four and going forward, because there's like double episodes, I believe, in the last three seasons, I might release two episodes at a time, but in one video, if that makes sense. So I've seen other people do this when there's like a lot of episodes, they'll release two episodes in one video. Now, I've never really, loved that concept, but um, it does make sense in a way uh, just to get through the, the episodes faster, I guess, or to get them out to you guys faster. Um, I don't know. You guys let me know what you prefer. Do you still want me to do uh, one episode um, per week, but like a fuller, like how I've been doing, like a 30 minute episode? Or would you prefer I give you two episodes a week, but in one video, so the reaction to each episode is going to be less. Like there will be less of the episode in the reaction. I hope that, I hope I'm making sense. Okay. You let me know what you guys prefer. Yeah. I mean, I'm fine with either. I just figured you guys might like the two episodes in one better. Um, but yeah, you let me know. You let me know. Okay. That being said, let's get to this episode. Ah, I'm so excited. You know what to do, friends. Oh, it's hot. Grab your coffee or your water or your tea. Um, snacks, if you want to have some snacks. And by the way, if you do want to watch full episodes with me, uh, go ahead and check out my Patreon below. I post uh, the full episodes there. Um, everything's included. So if you're interested, go check it out. You also get episodes earlier than YouTube. All right, let's get started. Breaking point. Vikings. All right, here we go. Oh, he's still having trouble urinating. <sighs> not good, not good. He might, I wonder if he has, you know what? I wonder if he has like some internal bleeding or something, which would not be good. Is Ragnar gonna die? Cause he's not, you know, he doesn't look good. And back then, obviously they didn't, know that internal bleeding. I didn't know what it was, to be honest, but like back then they didn't know how serious it was. They didn't know what to do for it. 
I don't know. I'm worried. I'm really worried about Ragnar. I don't understand why we failed Ragnar. I did everything to make sure. Yeah. Was he knows. The others will try again tonight. They're gonna go again? I was not expecting that decision. Oh, there's Helga. So she hasn't told anybody yet, I'm assuming. I wonder if she will, though. Actually, I think she will. I just don't know when. I cannot believe they're going back. They lost so many people last episode. I mean, it's smart to go by the water, but Jesus. What are they? They have like 10 people. What are they doing? Go Lagatha. Those aren't all women, is it? Woman, woman. Woman, woman. Wait, are those all women? Uh-oh. They got alerted. <gasps> no, 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 no. No, 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 not the oil. Um, I don't know what the hell they're gonna do. Those are all, they're all women, pretty sure. That's very interesting. I wonder why they sent all the women. Smart, Lagatha. Okay. There's Ragnar. Okay, he knows they're in there then. Interesting, interesting. Oh, were they all? Okay, okay, that makes more sense. I was like, it can't just be the 10 women or whatever. Like there has to be more. So they were waiting to basically be let in, I'm assuming. Yeah, here they come, okay. That is smart. Attack at night when they're, you know, not as on guard, not as ready. There's the princess again. What the fudge is that thing? What is that? Uh, Floki's like, I'm out. Yeah, I don't know what the hell. Oh. Oh, man. That is just awful. That's smart, though. That is smart. But awful. Oh. God. Yeah, how do you get past that? I don't know. Oh, he's just gonna climb over, okay. Okay, Rolo. Okay. Interesting. Uh, princess, you might wanna, you know. You might wanna move out of the way. Yeah. I don't think you wanna stay there. So is Ragnar there by himself? Oh my god, he is just... I think Ragnar's gonna die, you guys. Oh, no, I can't. I can't. Mm -mm. No. Please tell me he doesn't die this season. Please tell me. 
like I already lost my favorite character. Ragnar's my second favorite character. <laughs> Please tell me. Oh my god. I'm gonna be really Johannes. upset if he dies. Johannes, you have to come. Excuse me. Does it not give them courage to see you? You are their commander. And you are the emperor. I thought you would come. I thought I would not have to plead, not when you heard that our beloved city was apparently not. Country. Because I know what your grandfather would have Ooh. done. He's not his grandfather. Alas for you, Count Todo. I am not like there my you grandfather. Go. I am not Charlemagne. Not his grandfather. There's Rollo being a beast again. I wonder if they're gonna make it this time. I don't know. They lost a lot, a lot of people. Second time they have to retreat. I'm telling you, they should have just left, regrouped everybody back at home, and then went back. Uh oh. Oh my god, Ragnar. Someone needs to help Ragnar. Oh, is that Ethelstan? Ethelstan, please help Ragnar. You guys. I'm just dreaming about Ethelstan. Oh shit. Is that all his blood? <sighs> Don't abandon me. Oh. He would never. He would never. What the fuck is that thing? Interesting. Okay, I know that Ragnar like sees things because he has the blood of Odin, right? Like he sees the future, maybe not the future, but he sees things. But that was a lot of blood. That's not good. I'm going to just prepare myself for Ragnar. I'm gonna try to prepare myself for Ragnar. I've never seen a man of such um, strength and such violence. Dying. This season. His name is Rollo. He is the brother of King Ragnar. Okay, here's Wessex. We haven't been to Wessex in a while. How's Alfred? Both are well. Good. And your husband, Aethelwulf, is even now returning home. His oh. mission in Mercia was successful. Very good. That I will protect you and your sons, especially <laughs> Alfred. Because he's awful stands. Anyone. We both know what my son is capable of. Yeah. What? Are you going to kill your own son? There must be recompense. Some reward. Of course. He's such a gross bastard. Oh. They are going to kill him? Uh oh, oh no. Oh. Well, I wasn't expecting that. Oh my god. How 
Ow. Oh my god. Are you serious? He just wants to do his daughter-in-law for whatever reason. It's gross, but then again, her hu then again, her husband is a fucking douchebag. So, but he's a douchebag too for taking advantage of her. I want you to be my mistress. And there it is. Then you will protect Alfred. And you. <sighs> that was a dumb, that was dumb. That was a dumb, that was a dumb thing they did. I didn't finish my thought. They could have used him. Well, they didn't win, but they definitely caused damage. Thank God. Your Highness, in the last few days, over 200 of our citizens have succumbed to this unknown sickness and died. Uh-oh, what is it? What's more? We are running out of fresh vegetables, fresh food. The city is beginning to starve. What is your advice? I believe we must attempt to come to terms with them. Mm -hmm. There is a last no other way. So is there a plague going on? Okay, there they are. Where's Ragnar? He's right there. <sighs> I don't know if he's going to make it through this. He is not good. A toast to my son. I give thanks to God for your success and safe return. Hmm. I hope the king does not knock up Judith and then she gets in trouble for it. Because I could see that happening. She needs to sleep with her husband. Just in case. Uh, know what I mean? Oh, I think I see Bjorn. Yep. Good, he's recovered. Okay. Ragnar looks a little bit better. King Ragnar. The Franks want to discuss a way to end the siege. Why? They believe it would be better for both sides. Why would that be better for us? Oh, look. Rolo finally has a shirt on. <laughs> and armor. What will they give us if we lift the siege? That would be decided at a meeting between you and the commander of the city, Count Odo. Tell them I'll have the answer tomorrow. They lost their hostage. Why did they offer terms if they are so sure we cannot get into the city? Mm. They have probably run out of food. And disease. We should let them starve. I have something to say. Before he kills over. King Ragnar. That is my name. What does a king do? Yeah. He rules. Yes! And as a ruler, I... Have the <laughs> say. Me! Now. There's no more discussion. We shall meet the Franks tomorrow. Is he gonna live that long? Is not here. What? He left. By himself? How much treasure do you want to live? Oh, he went by himself. Oh, he has the cross. There is something I also seek that has no tangible worth. But to me is more precious. I want to be baptized. Oh. I'm a dying man. Mm -hmm. And when I die, he wants to be with Ethel Stan. I want to be reunited with my Christian friend. They will make arrangements for the ceremony. This is a man of God. 
Is it not? This... So just do it now. Yeah, there you go. Here's water. Am I wrong? You will do it here. And you will do it now. Oh, yeah. He, does he, he knows he doesn't have enough time. Deus tut create. This is so sad, you guys. Oh no, they're gonna see him getting baptized. What are they gonna do? He wants to be with Ethel Stan so bad he's getting baptized. Uh-oh. Yeah, I don't think they're gonna like that. Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Alright, friends, so that was the end of that episode. Breaking point. Great episode. I really, really enjoyed it. Though I'm, I'm really scared that Ragnar is going to die in the next episode. I just... I mean, they're setting it up for that. He he got baptized because he believes that he's dying. And honestly, he doesn't look good. Um, I just don't want him to die, you guys. I don't want him to die. I know it was probably an inevitable um, during the show, but <sighs> I'm like, we've already lost Ethelstan. Now, if we lose Ragnar, I, I mean, I, lo I like Bjorn, and I like Lagatha, but I don't like them as much as Ragnar and um, Ethelstan. Like, those two of my favorites. Those are my two favorites. And one's gone. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Didn't mean to flip you guys off. Um, one is gone, and I feel like the other one's going to be gone next episode. And if not next episode, then very soon into the fourth season. I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be sad when it happens because I feel like it will happen. I don't know if it'll be next episode, but I thought that was so freaking sweet and just beautiful that he just wants to be with his his best friend who he just loves so much. He wants to be with Ethel Stan so much that he's willing to get baptized, you know, because he thinks that's what he needs to be with him. Even though he doesn't, by the way, but the fact that he did that and that that was the most important thing to him. I mean, that's, that's, you can only hope, right? You can only be so lucky in life to have amazing an amazing friend like that, you know, or amazing friends if you're lucky. I'm really lucky that I do have a few friends that I'm extremely close to and love them so much and um, I would do anything for them and they're like family, you know, and uh, that's what Ragnar had with, with, Elf with Ethelstan and um, oh, it's just beautiful to see, but yeah, I think his end is coming and I'm not, I'm going to try to be prepared for it, but I don't think I'm going to be prepared for it when it actually comes. <sighs> I think I'm going to, I'm just going to be destroyed like I was with Ethel Stan, I think. I'm just not going to be, I'm not going to be ready. The rest of the episode I also enjoyed. Uh, I was kind of surprised that they tried to get back into Paris again. And that was interesting though, how they did it, how they sent women in at night, just a few women, to like infiltrate and get the door open so the rest of them could come in. They were very smart about it. So that was, that was really cool. Um, but I wonder what's going to happen now because Lagatha and Bjorn and Rolo saw and Floki 
what Ragnar did. And even though they're he's his, their king and they love him and their family, like I feel like they're not going to be happy about that because he basically just disgraced, I guess, their gods. I don't know if you could put it that way. <sighs> what else? Like, is that the only thing he wanted? And then he's just going to be like, okay, I got what I wanted, so let's leave. Or is there going to be more stuff that he's he wants from the people of Paris? I don't know. I See, I thought he was going to say, um, when he said there's something more important to me, I thought he was going to say, like, I want to go in and see your city and just be in the city, explore your city, you know. I don't know why, because I because Ethel Sam was talking about how he loved Paris, and then when he saw when Ragnar saw Paris when he was fighting, he was just so amazed by it. So I thought maybe that's what he was gonna ask, but this is better, him being baptized, because he feels like he's dying. So anyway, those are my thoughts for this episode. I'm excited for the next one. Uh, thank you so much for watching with me, friends. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe below to my channel. Um, if you, again, uh, what am I saying? What am I saying? If you would like to check out my Patreon, please do so below. I post uh, full episodes down there that you can watch with me and they always come out sooner than YouTube. So if you're into that, go check that out. Um, that's about it. All right. Thanks friends. I'll see you on the next episode. Bye.